there are times when I represent the landlord. More times than not, I represent the tenant. An eviction can be filed when the lease agreement has been breached. A lease agreement is a, is a contract. And so if a tenant fails to pay rent on time, that's the number one reason for evictions. They really do care about money. However, if there has been a crime committed or there has been noise violations and multiple complaints by other tenants, those could possibly also lead to evictions. One thing about the state of Georgia is that landlords cannot self-evict. That means that they do not get to go into the property, change the locks, throw their items out. They have to go through the judicial process. They have to file an eviction with the courts, allow that process to play out, and that is how they can evict a tenant. And it's a process, and it's an expedited process, actually, because the landlord files the eviction for non-payment of rent. The tenant has seven days to respond. Once the tenant responds with an answer and possibly a counter complaint, because that happens a lot, uh, then the hearing will usually be set within seven days of that answer being filed. And then the hearing will subsequently be scheduled seven days after that. So we're talking about a, something that moves very, very rapidly uh, and the parties end up in court very quickly. Uh, but those are the instances in which a landlord can uh, file an eviction.